My name is Rex Power Cold. I'm a Cyber Commando, Mark IV designation. My mission is to protect and serve the United States of America. For the past decade, the US of A has been at war with the Communist Empire of Vietnam. It's the fourth war we fought against them. But this one's different, because the Reds have managed to master Blood Dragon Tech. I don't understand. And I don't give a shit how they did it. I'm just here to shoot people in the face. But what I get is they're tapping blood dragons for energy and turning their blood into weapons, and that we can't stand. That's why they sent the best of the best of the best to end it once and for all. The one on the bike? That's not me. Rex Cold has been gone for nine years. That's one of my kids. You heard me. Kids. Twelve years ago, I fell for a lady. Dr. Elizabeth Darling, the most beautiful woman I ever saw. We got married, had twins together, a boy and a girl. Girl's name is Roxanne. She's a smart one. You want something done stealthy with a light touch? You call her. And the boy here, Slater. Best rider I've ever seen. Totally fearless and a hell of a shot. Nine years ago, it all went to shit. My wife disappeared, left me, left us. Not even a note. Just vanished. Me, I couldn't look at the kids because every time I did, it reminded me of her. I looked for her everywhere, but no luck. She was gone. So I flew to Nam and I fought that damn war by myself. Guess what? I lost. I died. The Rex Colt you knew is no more. The good thing was General Mason Ryback came along to take care of them once I was gone. Turned them into cyber commandos, too. Mark VI's latest tech, hiding all cybernetics under living tissues. It only makes sense for my kids to follow in daddy's footsteps. Like Slay there, on a mission to rescue POWs just like I would have. I couldn't be proud of what those kids are about to do.
soldiers have been taken prisoner by the VCOMs. We are America. We leave no man behind. Bring them home. Our objective in NAM is simple, Corporal. We need to put down the commie's commander. If we rattle the cage enough, the beast will come out in the open. That will not be easy. He's a cautious man. But if we destabilize the region enough, that'll draw him out. He'll show his damn face, and after that, well, all we have to do is locate and terminate. In the end, it all comes down to this. We eliminate bad guys, and this one is no different. Carry on, Corporal. Could you turn it down just a little, Slay? Some of us are studying for our next mission. Some of us are studying for our next mission. Whatever you say, Mom. I'm not your mom. I'm your sister. Okay, that was totally badass. If you'd studied, you'd have known how to dodge that. <laughs> you know, sis, for a total nerd, you're all right. <laughs> and for a bratty younger brother? By six minutes. You're okay, too. Corporal Colt, you need to infiltrate the enemy compound. Hack their mainframe and find the location of their energy source. This gig is a stealth mission. That means drop the bike as soon as you can. Clear? Clear. I just jumped over the fence, and I'm ready to hack away soon. something you never heard of. Discreet. Enemy spotted. Before he 
shoots you. Security level four reached. I have to admit it, I'm the best. Security level five reached. Okay, rocks, you're almost there. to mainframe computer granted. Sir, in five minutes, you'll have the exact location you requested. Several turrets in one blow. 
I think I just came up with a plan to destroy the mother. What's that? Go straight in, destroy everything I find on the way, and drive the vehicle directly into the tumor. Subtle. Right down your alley. I know, right? Can't help it if I got all the brains. Thank <laughs> you. 